for about a month now I've been brainstorming with the idea of wanting to ride my bike across Canada in the summer and um, I want to make a movie about it. There's nothing. This is a 110 kilometer stretch. But there's nothing. Just this highway cutting through it. And so that means I got about 70 kilometers tomorrow if I hope to get to where people are. Lanark Avalanche Shed, 1960. Covered about a little under a thousand kilometers and I've lost 20 pounds. And with about 7,000 kilometers left to go, I gotta learn to start eating more even though I don't find myself hungry. It's completely crazy. So you can't find a place to camp, and there's maybe one tree every 50 kilometers, and I'm not joking. I'm, I'm working in school, I'm a teacher. Oh, okay. <laughs> what do you teach? Uh, French immersion in BC. Okay. Grade 6, 7. Our environment Canada forecast for the Swift Current region today, a mix of sun and cloud, risk of a thunderstorm, wind becoming west 40 kilometers per hour, gusting to 60 this morning. Oh, I love Saskatchewan. Cruising at 43 kilometers an hour. All right, well, because I'm getting sick of uh, riding against the wind here today. Um, I thought I'd check out this abandoned house and see what's inside of it. And this whole area is actually really littered with them, so I'm always curious to see what's inside, so let's take a look. <laughs> Would it be a problem if I put up a tent in your yard for the night? In the backyard, out of the way, maybe? Or... Well, no, no, yeah, I guess. I can maybe have light. It's Mike. I just wanted to check in and let you guys know that I'm just getting ready to cross into the Manitoba border right now. And everything's going fine. And um, I should be in Winnipeg in four days or something. And that's about it. And don't worry about me. And that's all. Bye. Mark Gower right now. We went out to uh, Winnipeg. That's where I believe Mike Boshoff is joining us from this morning. He is cycling across Canada and Winnipeg is his latest city that he calls home. Well, why, why exactly are you doing this? I don't know. I graduated and wanted to get out of Windsor for a bit. I don't know. I can't tell you. <laughs> nothing to do, right? Yeah. Had four months. You know, nothing else to do. And a bicycle. And, you know, I 
I can't explain it. And the fact that I've been continually losing weight for the past um, good month, two months almost, and um, one of the bad things about that I've noticed is that my leg muscles have really lost muscle mass, and um, my legs have gotten a lot smaller, and I've also noticed that they've gotten considerably weaker. This is our talking place, our parliament. Oh, fuck. Oh, thunderstorm. Cold outside. Very cold. I don't know. I, can, I, I don't know if I can stress this enough. I think after this, I'll have to sleep two more nights in this tent, which I've actually grown to really, really like.